everybody, welcome back. Uh, a few weeks ago, there was a store championship at Galway, Dungeons Donuts. Thank you for always hosting great events from locals to store championships. Unfortunately, I did not win that one, but a good friend, Stephen, did win and he is was kind enough to share his deck profile with us. It is a security control BT6 deck and unfortunately he couldn't be here to tell me about it himself. So he sent me on some pictures and some notes, which I'm going to share with all of you now. Make sure to go to topdecktcg.com and use code BOBAY10 for 10% off your next purchase. So here is our deck profile. Now, like I said, he couldn't be here to explain it himself, but he did give me some notes and he's broken it up into different sections rather than going by level. But I guess, first of all, we'll start with the eggs. So there's four Upamon. Um, this is for a little bit of draw power when you have a Salamon to put on the egg. And also um, it is for being able to use your yellow Digimon cards and your yellow option cards, especially. So you just either leave the egg leave the egg there so you can use your yellow option cards or just put a Salamon on top of it and don't bring the Salamon out until you're going to use it. So the Salamon, the Reinforced Memory Boost, the Holy Wave and the Tactical Retreat. So this section up top here, this is all your healing package in the security control deck as a whole. So this will keep adding more security cards on top. So you can just keep recycling what's going in there. So then the other yellow cards that you have up top here, the um, Eden's Javelin and the Wavering's Breath is all about DP reduction. This is for getting past blockers, especially. Um, also there are bombs in the security, which is fantastic. Then next up we have, you have the black package. So you've got your Izzy and your Joe, Iron Fisted Onslaught and Ultimate Flare. And again, it's a lot of, hard removal great in security and great for just straight up removing cards so i'll go with the cards underneath the black cards are your security digimon so your cordramon and your geo Greymon, they come out in from your security geo Greymon is removal so cordramon allows you is your pot of green you can draw two cards good so far we're hanging we're hanging in there like i said um I've never played security control before myself, but I have the general gist of what's going on with it, which is great. And this looks like a very, very good list. And he's done very well with this list on many occasions. So next up we have our Omnimon package. There's four Omnimons worth defeat and one Omnimon X antibody. This worth defeat, obviously they come out um, in security, which is really cool. And then finally we have the BL star package. So that's your BL star mon, your happy bullet sharing and your guilt Schwarmer. Happy bullet sharing activates in security, which is really cool. And BL star mon for every seven costs in your grave, you get to reduce your distribution cost by one. Also a very, very cool card. You can also digivolve your Zwart defeat on top of BL star to get rid of tamers. Anyway, his matchups for the store championship event were round one, he played against Jessmon. Round two, he played against Lilith Loop. And round three, he played against Musketeers, which was me. And it was a very, very close and very tough game for the both of us. He came out victorious and an absolute well-deserved win. He knows this deck very well. Everything in it has a purpose and it synergizes very well with each other. I hope you liked this short video on security control. I'll have to get Steven on to talk a bit more about it the next time he wins, which I'm sure will be very soon enough. Again, thank you all for hanging about and I will see you all next time.